Hey guys, welcome to another episode, now the tension is over, finally the profit. With this strategy you are now going to make profit. In this video we are going in depth about our top 2 best indicator trading strategies and how do we use these indicators in conjunction with price action. As always we will have lots of practical examples, the idea which is to fully understand these amazing trading indicators. Coral Trend Strategy is a very powerful strategy. This stands for Trend Average Price. It is very powerful for traders as it takes into account both price and volume. This wonderful trading strategy and to make the most out of it if you want more videos more often please smash the like button subscribe and turn on the notifications bell so that you know exactly when new content is released. A very important point before we start everything we discuss in this video can be used for currency trading, stock trading and crypto because price action remains relatively consistent across different assets so we're going to go very in depth in this video. We will try not to make the video too long. We hope that you will definitely like this strategy video. First of all let us know about trading tools. The buy and sell color indicator we see in the chart is called the coral trend indicator. The indicator is bottom, we call it PP signal ADX slash DI histogram. Now we tell you how we want to trade. Let's start. First of all we open 5 minutes chart of Apple. We will be using two indicators in this strategy. We will search Coral Trend Indicator in the search box of Trading View. After that we have to click on Coral Trend Indicator option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to keep as hide these options. Smoothing as 32, Constant D as 1. The indicator changes color, based on the change in the direction of the trend. If the Super Trend Indicator moves below the closing price, then the indicator turns green and gives a buy signal. If a super trend closes above, then the indicator shows a sell signal in red. After that we have to apply another indicator on the chart. We will search PP signal ADX slash DI histogram in the search box of trading view. After that we have to click on PP signal ADX slash DI histogram option. In which we have to change some setting. We have to keep length as 14, threshold as 25. BB periods as 13, deviations as 0.618. We have to keep as hide these options. Opacity has to be increased. ADX is non-directional and quantifies trend strength by rising in both uptrends and downtrends. When the plus DMI is above the DMI, prices are moving up, and ADX measures the strength of the uptrend. When the DMI is above the plus DMI, prices are moving down, and ADX measures the strength of the downtrend. Let's see how we use these trading tools. Let's start. When the coral trend indicator gives us sell signals. When the PP signal ADX DI indicator should be red color. When the market form a bearish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the high of the previous market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy. Let us now understand the long position. When the coral trend indicator gives us buy signals. When the PP signal ADX DI indicator should be green color. When the market form a bullish candle. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss will be placed at the low of the previous market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. The market has completely hit the target. I hope you must have understood this trading strategy if not, then it doesn't matter, we are going to see examples of some trades, so that you will definitely understand. If you have any question related to this strategy, then you can ask in the comment section, we will try our best to answer all your questions. Here the coral trend indicator gives us sell signals. Here the PP signal ADX DI indicator is red color. The market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. 
our stop loss will be placed at the high of the previous market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. Here the coral trend indicator gives us buy signals. Here the PP signal ADXDI indicator is green color. The market has made a bullish candle to give confirmation. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place by order. Our stop loss will be placed at the low of the previous market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. We have won the trade. Let's find the next trade. Here the coral trend indicator gives us sell signals. Here the PP signal ADXDI indicator is red color. The market has made a bearish candle to give confirmation. If this condition is fulfilled then we will place sell order. Our stop loss will be placed at the high of the previous market. And the risk to reward ratio will be 1 is to 1.5. Let's see what happens to our trade. Our trade is running in profit. We have won the trade. I hope you must have liked this trading strategy. If you are new to our YouTube channel then please subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching our video. See you in the next video.